Hi, good morning everyone. Today we will learn character building with Mimi Fina. Today we are going to learn Unit 8. My country is the best. Do you know what is the name of our country? Yes, of course. Our country is Indonesia. Indonesia has different culture, race, and religion, and also spoken language in daily activity. Indonesia has any particular food that's unique in every region too. So, are you proud to be Indonesian? The color of Indonesia's flag is red and white. And the national song of Indonesia is Indonesia Raya. Do you know that song? Now open page 50C. You can write our national song of Indonesia, Indonesia Raya, over here, okay? The next activity is open page 57. There is a story about a little boy who saved his son. A little boy was returning from the school in the late afternoon when he thought he heard the sound of running water. He stood still and listened. Like all the other little boys in his town, he knew that a crack in a drain would soon let the water in. It would flood in the land and bring ruin to the people. He saw a small hole where the water had begun to drip. He was still far from home. Even he were the run quickly and tell someone to come. It might already to be late. The water might have already flooded his son. He bent down on the cold damp ground and put his little hand into the hole where the water was running out. It was just a big enough to cover the hole and prevent the water from escaping. He decided to stay there till someone walked by. As time passed, he grew cold and hungry. Soon the sun began to set and the night grew dark. Still the little boy gave his hand in the hall. Several hours passed and at last he saw a streak of light across the sky. To his delight, some worker walked by and saw him kneeling on the ground with his little tiny hand still in the hall. That was how the little boy saved his son from the flood. Next, open page 58 and answer the question according to the story of the boy who saved his son. Point number one, what was the problem in the story? What did the little boy do to solve the problem? Number two is, which sentence in the third paragraph tell you that it was already morning? Number three, if you were a little boy, would you have done the same to save your turn from flooding? Explain your answer below. Okay, thank you for your attention. Bye. See you next time. Bye.